In this short video, we're going to take a look at, at another simple trading strategy, looking at the idea of trading with the trend. Hello, I'm David Jones from Capital.com, and this is another in our series of short videos on simple trading strategies. Trading doesn't have to be complicated, and I think if you've ever done any research or reading, you will have seen the phrase, the trend is your friend. You know, trading in the direction of the trend means you're trying to put the odds in your favour. So how do we identify these trends and where are the, the good points, the low risk points to get in on a trend? Let's take a look at the charts. Let's take a look at the idea of um, trading with the trend. I thought we'd look at the, the Dow Jones, the US 30 index, very popular market uh, during 2018. And look, we, we see the start of a trend here and the definition of an uptrend, we have higher highs and higher lows and the market starts to move higher. Let's just pick up on it with our drawing tool. I'll scroll down and pick trend. So here's our simple trend line. The assumption is whenever the market sells off, we're looking for this trend line to hold. So we need two points to draw the start of the trend line and it's the third move here that confirms it. It comes back to here, it doesn't get quite back to the actual level, but you know this is a real market and it doesn't work uh, perfectly all the time where it's gonna come down to the exact spot. But the assumption is while we're above the trend, we're looking to be a buyer, so dips are viewed as buying opportunities. Let's just pick up on this sharper trend. So you can see here it's accelerated. So again, we've got a couple of points and it's the third point here that confirms it. So at the moment, at the time of recording, the Dow is trading around about 26,500. If it's sold off towards 26,000, it's still above the trend. So that weakness would be viewed as a buying opportunity. So in an uptrend, we're looking to buy. Let's take a look at downtrends. So here's the pound US dollar starting in May uh, 2018. Let's um, again just pick up on our trend here off these highs. So in a downtrend, we're going to pick up on the highs. Of course, in an uptrend, we pick up on the lows. So again, the assumption is every time we see the market come back to the trend line in a downtrend, we're expecting it to run out of steam. And this worked pretty well in holding the market lower. We had that rally in late July up towards the 132 level, and then it turned and fell heavily. And it's here we get the trend line break. We're going to talk about this in another video. But for now, when we're looking at the trend, we're just looking at following that trend, using the trend line as a simple guide as to where we're expecting the market if it rallies in a downtrend to run out of steam or if it falls in an uptrend to bounce back. And it's a really simple method. You see these trend lines over all sorts of different time frames, whether you're looking at daily, weekly or short term charts, such as hourly in 10 minutes. So it doesn't work all the time, but it can help you trade with the momentum of the market. You're putting market sentiment on your side. So whatever time frame you're trading, it normally makes sense to try and trade in the direction of the trend and we can identify that uh, using trend lines whether the market's been rising or whether it's been falling. Like I say it doesn't work all the time which is where stop losses come in to manage our risk but the idea is that if we lock into a trend hopefully we'll end up with profits that do end up being bigger than our potential losses. We'll wrap things up there as usual. Um, don't forget there's a whole host of other content that we have out there on our YouTube channel, trading strategies, looking at markets such as currencies and indices. To never miss out, uh, just make sure you're subscribed by clicking the subscribe button uh, down there. Click the alarm bell notification and you get automatically notified every time we upload uh, a new video. But for this short introduction on trend trading, uh, we'll leave it there. So from me, David Jones and Capital.com, good luck with your trading. Yeah.